Christmas I gave you my heart. Hi everyone, so today I am doing my um my I'm going to be showing you guys what I got for Christmas because I've actually been really enjoying these videos. Um, they're all over YouTube at the moment. Every YouTuber's been doing them, so I thought, why not show you guys what I got? So I don't have everything that I got because I got like chocolates and stuff like that as well. So uh, that's all gone. Obviously, it's like what a week after Christmas. <laughs> Obviously, that'd be all gone. So I'll show you guys um, the first thing that I got. Oh, by the way, I am not trying to brag in any way. Um, I'm very grateful for the stuff that I got for Christmas. I'm not spoiled at all. I get a decent amount of stuff and I'm so grateful for everything that I got. So yeah, I'll show you. The first thing that I got was my best favorite thing. And I got a Polaroid camera and I'm so excited for this. This is like my best favorite present that I got and I love it. And basically you gotta buy the film for these. So. <clears throat> oh my gosh. You have to buy the film. Um, and it's really, really expensive. So it takes the mini, the Fujifilm Instax mini <clears throat> um, films, and they come like this in this little container, and you just insert it into the back. And I got a two pack, and this was $30 for 20 pieces of film. And I'll just show you guys. Um, it takes mini ones so they're about this big that's Isaac that's Isaac again and then this one like um, some of them turned out like really dark I took one of my dog Scruffy that's Scruffy that's my dog Scruffy and um, yeah I absolutely love it and I got it in the white and this is actually from JB Hi-Fi because um, I actually picked it out it was yeah I actually picked it out so um, they came in white and black. I'm pretty sure this comes in pink. They just didn't sell the pink one. Um, but you can get it from other places. So if you would like a pink one, definitely go check that out. But yeah, I definitely recommend getting one of these. I think they're about $100. Um, this was on sale for like 80 It was like 75 or something around Christmas time. So that's why I got it. And then, yeah, you're going to spend a lot of money on these things. But um, yeah, and it does say that it only takes these ones. So yeah. So that's a that. Then I got um, a bunch of perfumes. So I'll start with the first one. So I got the Taylor Swift Wonderstruck in a gift set. And it came with, um, I think it's body gel and a moisturizer or a hand cream. And I got this one because this is like, I feel like five together than all of them. I got this one because I just recently liked it. At first when it came out, I didn't like it. And Every time I went to the perfume store, I would smell this, and I was like, oh my god, it smells really good. So I asked for this one, um, only because the Taylor by Taylor Swift was really, really expensive, and I wanted to get the bigger one. So I'll wait for that to go down on sale, because I don't like paying a lot of money for perfumes. Um, yeah, just because, like, I mean, I do have them for ages, usually, so, unless it's like one of my favorites, but yeah, I got that. And then from my boyfriend, he bought me the Jimmy Choo perfume, and this is actually a refill, if you would say. Um, I already have it. I got it for my 21st last year, and I absolutely love it. I saw Shanex so rave about this, and I was like, oh my god, I should go check it out. And I went and smelled it, and I absolutely loved it. And it's almost all gone. I probably have like this much left, so I'm going to refill on that. And then <clears throat> I got um, Sarah Jessica Parker's New York City or NYC, I'm not sure how you pronounce it. You just open up the lid and it looks like that. It's got this really pretty, um, <clears throat> oh my god, I'm sorry guys, but I'm getting a sore throat. <clears> throat> um, it's got this really pretty like patterned bottle and I got this from my boyfriend's little brother. And it smells so good. I absolutely love it one of my favorites. So I got that. And then I got JLo Live Lux, which looks like this. And it's a really pretty bottle. And it smells so good. I could literally eat it. It smelled like... I threw away all the boxes, so I can't describe the scent. I should have Googled it before I did this video. <clears throat> it just smells like really fruity and a little bit musky. So if you like those, and this is the large bottle and it's like pink and green and blue and I mean red, blue and yellow. That's really, really pretty. 
Um, so I ended up getting two OPI nail polishes, but I accidentally broke one the other day. It went all over my old Duna cover and I had to chuck it out because it stained because it was black and glitter. But then I also got this one. It is Did It On Em, which is actually from the Nicki Minaj collection and it is this really pretty like lime green colour and I absolutely love it. I cannot wait to try. I actually have um, shellac on my nails at the moment. So I cannot wait to try that. And then um, my boyfriend's sister got me some makeup. She's so naughty. She got me this Too Faced pack, which um, if you're wondering where you can buy Too Faced in Australia, there are shops called Mika Maxima or Mika Cosmetica. They have one at Rubina and Carindale and I think one in the city. And they sell Too Faced, Smashbox, Bare Minerals, Soap and Glory. Um, they sell Clarisonics and stuff like that. And she got me this little kit. comes in this little bag. It's so cute. And then it's got some little um, sample size stuff in it. So the first thing you get is this um, Too Faced eyeshadow and blush duo. So you get two eyeshadows and a blush. And I used the eyeshadows on my eyes today. And I have to say I really, really like it. I especially like this champagne-y brown colour. It's really, really pretty. And then it's just got a mirror. You can see my film makes up. Ooh, I film on an iPhone. Great. No. Sucks. Um, so you get that in there. And then you get this Too Faced um, lipstick in the colour Believe. And it's just like a plummy, pinky colour. And yeah, I really like that. It's really good for every day. And then you get um, a Shadow Insurance Anti-Crease Eyeshadow Primer, which I've been dying to try. And I tried it today, and so far, well, so far so good, because I do get that problem of my eyeshadows creasing. Especially in summer, because it is summer here in Brisbane. So, got that in there. And then you get um, this Too Faced Perfect Eyes Waterproof Eyeliner. And it's just, again, just a travel size, and I used it um, the other day, and it's really, really good. It's really pigmented, and you just literally do, like, one stripe on your tart line, and on your waterline, and that, and it's, like, amazing. And then I got the Too Faced Lash Injection Extreme Volume Tubing Mascara, and again, it's just a little travel sample size, but I think these are really good, especially for traveling or you go over your friend's house all the time it's really great and the brush just looks like that and yeah I like it um, the formula is a little bit um, like it doesn't bring out a lot of product on the brush so you have to keep layering that's the only con I would say about it but other than that I really like it it's a good everyday mascara because you're not gonna want to have like big bold lashes every day so and I know some places like where you work and stuff they don't like you to have like a lot of makeup on so it'll be great for that and I just love the little bag, it's so cute. I can use this um, in my, put this in my handbag and just put all my everyday makeup in there and stuff. So yeah. Um, so I'll start, oh, I'll start with clothes. I got this top, which looks like this. And it's just like a long, flowy sunflower top. And this is from Melrose. And then I got this top here, which is from Ali Fashion. And it just looks like that, and then it's got these like little holes in it, and it's got this kind of damask. Oh, it's not really a damask pattern. It kind of is a damask pattern, but it's all these like vines weaving into each other, and yeah, I really like that. I thought it was different and nice and chic and all that. And that out there. And then I went and got. Well, I didn't get it. I got it given to me. I got two pairs of Converse's. Now, I wanted the white ones, but I couldn't find them in my size. Um, and especially at my Converse outlet. Um, you can imagine Christmas time, everyone was buying. And it was just crazy. And because the white ones that I wanted are universal, so they're men and women's shoe, um, the sizing is off. Um, so it's really hard for me to find my size because I really small feet, but white. Um, so that's it. Anyway, I got two pairs of the women's shoes. So the first pair that I got were these purple ones. And I have to say I freaking love them. I wore them to the movies though the other week and I got blisters to the max. But <laughs> it's because I didn't wear socks with them. Um, so what I'm going to do is, because I wore socks and then they looked weird because my socks were sticking out at the top. So I went like with no socks and they gave me the worst blisters. So I'm going to buy those little socket things, but the sock ones, not the stocking ones. 
and I think I'll be great for these. And I got these in a size, um, I think they're a size 5. Oh no they're not, they're a size 6, a US 6 and a UK 4. Um, and they're a woman's shoe and I believe these were $50 because I actually went to pick them out um, my boy because obviously he wanted me to pick them out and I had to try them on because my feet I have weird sizing sometimes I'm six sometimes I'm seven so yeah and then I got this really cute green pair and I love it I think they're so so cute and I just wanted to get into wearing more sneakery type shoes I think they look so cute especially with like a cute summer dress or high waisted shorts great these. So I got those and then I got this Duna cover that is on my bed. If you can see it's really pretty. It's got um, like um, glitter embellishments on it and it's so cute. And I got that from my boyfriend's mother. She, she just picks the best Duna covers. And then I got a ton of DVDs. DVDs and TV shows is like... Sorry about that, I just dropped my phone. Sorry about that, I just dropped my phone. I like slammed the drawer shut on my vanity. So we always get each other DVDs and TV shows and stuff for Christmas every year. So I thought, hey, why not ask for some? Um, the only one that I asked for was One Tree Hill, so I ended up getting One Tree Hill Seasons 1 to 4. I didn't get the box set because the box set was like $180 and I wasn't going to make my boyfriend pay for that. So my boyfriend got me Seasons 1 and 2. Now I don't have one on me because it's at his house, I was watching it with his sister. Um, but this is Season 2 and then my boyfriend, my boyfriend, my brother went and got me Seasons 3 and 4. Um, and I'm going to buy the rest. Um, once I get up to season 5 I'll go and buy the rest because I think there's 9 seasons but so far it's so good I love that and then um, I got season 1 of Suburbatory now if you have not watched this show you should definitely go watch it it is the best show ever I just love her sense of humour it's a very like quirky bit of a dry sense of humour but I love it um, and I love Dallas Dallas is my favourite if you watched it you'll know what I'm talking about um, and this is just season one. I'm not sure if there is a season two. If there is, let me know because I would like to get it. And this actually has a lot of episodes. I think it's got like 20 episodes. It's actually got 22 episodes. Which is more than what I thought because when they put it on TV, they kept, after a while, they just kept playing the same ones over and over again. And I swear that like we only watched about 10 of them. So um, we were watching this the other night and there was about, there was heaps that we hadn't seen. So I'm guessing on TV they just play the good stuff. Um, and then from my boyfriend's mum I got Harder of Dixie Season 1 and I'm so excited to start watching this. I haven't started it yet because we started One Tree Hill um, and I'm also in the middle of watching Gossip Girl. So I think when I finish Gossip Girl I'll start this. Um, or I probably won't, I'll just start watching it. My mum wants to watch it with me and I love Rachel Bilson, I love The O.C. When it was out so devastating they only made four seasons that show could have gone on to do 10 seasons like it could have if they didn't kill off marissa so i'm really excited to start watching this and just take a moment to like look at her legs like that's what i want because she is short like me i am really really short and if i had legs like that i wouldn't give a crap if i was short um yeah so i bet you when i watch this i'm not gonna want to eat food because she's so damn skinny and i want to be like that <laughs> um so yeah, I got that, and then I'm so excited. So my favourite movies to watch are horror movies. So I got um, the whole collection of The Nightmare on Elm Street, and you get seven in this, and that's including the newest one that they remade, the Wes Craven's New Nightmare. I'm pretty sure that is the new one. <clears throat> yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the new one. So yeah, so it's got... um. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I always thought there was more than seven. Yeah. Oh, anyway, there's seven on there. I was just staring into nothing. But yeah, I'm really excited to like have a movie marathon and watch these because I'll probably do it next week or something. 
or maybe tonight. I don't know. So I've got those and still in plastic as you can see. I wanted to get the Friday the 13th as well and the Halloweens. I'm pretty sure I've got all the Halloweens. I've just need all the Friday the 13th. We've got like probably five of the Friday the 13th. Um, so what else did I get? I got some chocolates and um, I got like a Superman t-shirt as well but that's in the wash. That was just like a plain tea. Um, I'm trying to think. I feel like I've beginning to show you guys something. That's basically all I got. I um, didn't really get that much this year, but that is still a lot. I know some people only get like one or two presents and I'm so grateful for everything that I got. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Bye guys. Last Christmas I gave